Welcome back. Now, Jeff Bezos, owner of Amazon.com, recently bought the Washington Post for several times what anybody thought it was worth. I don't think he bought it because it's so profitable. I think he bought it because it's such a powerful weapon in Washington. And he's going to need that to clear the regulatory obstacles for what he wants to do next. He wants to set up a private delivery system using drones. Maybe he could call it Amadrone.com. John Bown has more on that. Amazon to fill our skies with drones within five years. What's not to love? You order the groceries online and we deliver them to your door. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Amazon CEO Jeff Bezos wants to feed America's need for instant gratification by accelerating the slippery slope of conditioning to accept drones as a way of life. He envisions a future where Amazon drones are whizzing by each other to get products to people in a half hour that may have taken days or weeks. But at what cost? If we can make this model work, it would be great because it extends the range of products that we can sell. Google has been painstakingly recording our privacy to populate their Google Maps. But the corporatocracy-run NSA needs more data. Who's to say? that Amazon doesn't open the door for more intrusive visits from Google, recording our family members, pets, and firearms. Publication Homeland Security Today obtained a copy of the test plan for the program, which also says sensor platforms are being tested that can distinguish between an unarmed and armed personnel. The Washington Times reported Michael Huerta, the chief of the Federal Aviation Administration predicted that U.S. airspace could be crowded with as many as 7,500 commercial drones within the next five years. But Huerta warns we need to be responsive to the public concerns about privacy. Given the revelations provided by Edward Snowden concerning the all-out war waged on our privacy by the NSA, all we can expect is more intrusion into our private lives. NSA and the intelligence community in general uh, is focused on getting intelligence wherever it can by any means possible. That it believes on the grounds of sort of a self-certification that they serve the national interest. John Baum, Infowars.com. Thank <laughs> you.